Hey Cody, this is Daniel from Josh and Danny SEO. So I'm just shooting you this video, spoke with Jake, he gave me the go ahead. Um, so it's just basically going through your website, kind of seeing what's going on, seeing if we can help you out with anything. So right away, you know, I love the logo up in the top right corner over here. You got some great, um, you know, you have a good header here. Um, request and estimate is excellent. Um, usually, you know, maybe have a number here as well, but you know, as we're going through this, uh, you know, I love, you know, you have a great picture in the background. Um, interior painting, learn more with a small explanation. That's great. Um, you know, as we keep on going through this, you know, this is your trust, which is excellent. Request a, you know, free consultation with a call to action button. That's excellent. And then, you know, obviously your specialties, again, you're going to go through all them and you can click, I believe, no, okay. We can't click on these, um, for more information, but then again, you do have again, where you can click for an estimate. And then we have your uh, reviews, which are great to have on your website, who you're trusted by. And then, you know, a little bit about you, all of the pages you have, and, you know, stuff like that. And then, again, call to action. So that's great. So, you know, overall, you have a really good website. The only thing I would kind of say is that, you know, Google is looking for about 1,500 to 2,000 words on the front home page. Um, otherwise, they're not going to spend that much time. They're also looking for buyer intent keywords. So what are people searching for on the Internet so that they can, you know, find your website? So, you know, a lot of buyer intent keywords is painters near me or painters in uh, Houston, Texas or Conroe, stuff like that. So I'm actually going to take a peek behind the curtain, see exactly what's going on on the back end of your website. So I use this uh, handy tool called Ahrefs. So right here we have uh, your URL rating which is basically how much, um, you know, sh how strong your website is, and then your DR rating, which is, you know, how much Google trusts your website. So um, you definitely want these to be, you know, three, uh, about 30 to 40 in that range, and a ratio of one to one. Now, how we get those to that area is we work with backlinks. So this is basically any other area where you have your, uh, your website that links right back to you. Um, so it looks like you actually have eight out of eight referring domains. Um, now, not all domains are created equal. Some of them are, you know, a bit uh, spammy. So, you know, Google doesn't care for them. And then you're going to have some that are going to legitimize your website even more. And we're looking for those specifically. But then what are people looking for? Organic keywords, right? So we got 31 here, but we're only pulling one person in a month through your website. So we're not really having a lot much there. Let's take a look at what those organic keywords actually are. So oh, right here, we're always going to look for volume, right? We just got to wait for that to load. So we're always looking for volume. So you have one great keyword in here, painters in spring, Texas. It's very specific. Got 200 um, people searching for that a month. Unfortunately, we're not getting any traffic because we're only in position 22, which is on the second page of Google. People don't really go there. So as we go through, right, precision painting reviews, you know, people click on that, sure, but it's not a buyer intent keyword. They're looking, but it's not really getting anywhere. Painting the woodland. So that's a great one. It's bringing in 400 people. But again, we're only on page two, almost three, when we're looking at these keywords. Precision painting, again, that's you guys. Woodlands painting, 400, level 44 here. So we're not really ranking very high, even though we have some great, um, Great things to look at here. This is 700 um, people clicking on this for looking for Texas painting, you know, but unfortunately we're not getting anywhere with it because you're, again, like level, you're on the, the fourth page here. So we have some good keywords here, you know, with intent. We're looking for high volume here, um, but we're just not really ranking high enough to get some of these. And a lot of these keywords aren't exactly buyer intent, like invoice for painting. That's probably very specific to your website. Um, but again, we're only getting 95, uh, you're, you're in the ninth page here. So let's take a look at, you know, what people do search for, right? So we got painter spring, Texas. That's going to be a bigger one. So right here, you have your Google ads, a bit more ads, you know, it's just people who want to jump to the front of the line and get noticed. Um, you know, they're willing to pay for that service right under here. We have, uh, the Google map pack. So we definitely want to get people in here. This is where uh, about 30 to 40 percent of people search for um, for someone. So you definitely wouldn't want to be in the top three here. There are various ways to get people in here, but we can always discuss that um, or you can always look into that on your own. Some of it's just like replying to your customer reviews, you know, making sure that your name, number, address is the same across all platforms, stuff like that. But then we have, you know, 
kind of the generic organic uh, area here. We want to definitely get in this uh, spot. But right now, Yelp, I'm going to ignore. Let's just go to Painting Spring, Texas. This is your first one uh, that's going to be uh, as far as competition goes. Uh, and let's take a look at what they got. So they have a nice little logo here. They're about um, header, and they have their click to call button here. So they do it again, which is nice. They have a nice little picture here. As we're scrolling down, they have a lot going on over here. Services in Spring, Texas, um, residential painting services. So they do have some keywords going through. Um, they're also going and telling us a little bit about everything, a um, little bit about the company, what they do. Um, kind of going through, they have a nice little website uh, set up over here. Some videos, um, the reviews, excellent call to action button again, and then about us. Kind of just like their ending page here. So let's take a look behind the scenes over there and let's find out what's going on. So their uh, domain rating, their uh, sh uh, strength of the website is actually really good. They have about 27, but their trust with Google is very low. And again, that comes down to backlinks. They have about 615, but only 56 referring domains. And again, may many of those may not even be really good ones. That's why they have a low trust rating. So the thing that they do have for them is they have organic keywords. And even though they do have 352, again, not all are equal. They're only pulling 42 organic traffic a month. So let's see some of the keywords they're doing. Uh, they got, you know, painters in Spring, Texas, 200, again, just like you. The difference is, is that while you are on page two, they're on page one. So they're able to utilize that traffic over here. They're getting 26 people just with that keyword alone. Pete's Painting is their website. I'm not really going to look, but hiring painters near me, 700. The only issue with this, it's a very generic keyword. So he got, he's on the second page here. He got one person that month. So he's got some keywords, but none of them are actual buyer intent keywords. They're not, you know, Painting Spring is good, but he's also on the 28th page. So he's got the keywords involved. Um, a lot of these, though, from what I'm seeing, are just very generic. They're, you know, for everyone in the United States. They're not just for people in the area. So he's not really going to do very well with those either. So all honesty, um, Cody, all we really got to do to help you win, we just got to boost these backlinks up by, you know, like another 100 backlinks or, or so. Get some really strong referring domains so we can help with your UR and DR rating with Google. So we get a strong website. Add, you know, 1,500 to 2,000 words to the front page. Getting in those organic keywords that people are searching for. Remember, we got to think what the customer is thinking when they're searching for a painter. And then, you know, boost the organic keywords so that we have the right ones in there boosting our organic traffic. Hey, if you can bring in an additional 50 people, you know, let alone 200 people through your website, what does that mean for you? This is all I got for you, Cody. Um, you know, if you have any feedback for me, I'd be more than happy, uh, you know, to hear from you. If you have any more questions about anything I went over, please feel free to reach out for that as well. Uh, otherwise, you have an amazing day, man. Enjoy.